Ah, uh, so we're back on the ship, put on our swim trunks, and we are in the quiet cove. The Saints are winning. They're beating uh, the uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. 25, 25 to, 14. to 14. Yeah. We got this. <laughs> so yeah, who dat? Who dat? So we're at the Quiet Cove, or the, yeah, I think it's called, yeah, Quiet Cove Pool, adults only pool. We're, uh, got on our swim trunks, swimsuits. Uh, Jason's got him a cold beer. I got me a cold diet, uh, Coke Zero. You need other cold beer out of that. You need your other cold beer. And we're just gonna chill. We're gonna get in the pool, relax, watch Sail Away from it's, right it's here. It's our first port day. This is what we do. It's yep. kind of a tradition. Because we got two more port days back to back after this. And they're long port days. So we're probably not going to fill up to it after that. So this is probably our best day where we'll fill the most up to it. At some point, we'll probably get on the water slide at least once. Yeah. But other than that, we're going to be back here in the quiet we'll cove. We'll get the hot tubs. Oh my God, that's like such a picturesque view right there. We've got sailboats and this beautiful sunset or beginning of us. Look how gorgeous this is. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. Wow. So we're leaving. Goodbye. Well, these are not key. This is not Key West. I don't know what these two little islands are called. Key West is on the other side of the ship. They said there's 800 keys in the Florida Keys. Yeah. And uh, this is the Florida Strait where the Atlantic meets the Gulf. Yeah, that's cool. So we learned stuff today. Yeah. Let's go to the other side of the ship and watch Key West. Look at all the people out watching us sail away. They're just watching us? Yeah, they're just watching us. Look at all those people watching us sail away. Shoot, I'd be I'd be sitting watching this ship sail away too. It's pretty cool. Yeah, see all the people? Pretty neat. Well, heading out from Key West, Florida. Beautiful port. Yeah. Amazing day. We had a fantastic day here. Oh, there's the lighthouse over there. We drove by that on the hop on, hop off trolley. Yeah. There's that ball over there. The big yeah. So the southernmost point right over here. Yeah. Between the lighthouse and that ball. Yeah, you can tell we're turning. Look at the land, look at the ship. Bye, Key West. We are officially on our way off. Heading to Castaway Key. Heading to Castaway Key. Yes. Yes. 
That just scared the Mickey bejesus out of me. I know, me too. <laughs> Underneath. Oh, so they're gonna having a wedding or something right there. Oh, they are. I saw some guys in tuxedos today. Beautiful. Wow, how'd you like to get married there? Let me see if I can zoom in a bit on that. They're all taking pictures of the ship. They're all, they're all taking pictures. Congratulations. I hope. Yeah. They're getting married and taking pictures of us. <laughs> Well, the Disney horn just gave him a tip, yeah. a tip of the hat. So we're we're sailing now away from Key West. Uh, me and Jason, we're just we're still in the adults only uh, co quiet cove area. We're just chilling. We're straight up chilling. Just uh, been on our feet all day. Probably yeah. We had a great day, it's been relaxing, but you know, after four days, it's always just a little bit of taxing. So we're kicking our feet up. Yep. Hang here for a bit, and then we'll decide what we're gonna do tonight. Key West, we kind of made. I watched this amazing sunset. It's just so beautiful. Unbelievably beautiful. Oh, look at my honey bear. He said to come to deck four, and he was right. Look how beautiful. It's not windy out here. No, it's not windy. We've still got the sunset happening right now. Sailing through the beautiful blue water. So we were just recapping our day and thinking about how much we absolutely loved Key West. Yeah. This was really fun. Yeah, it's a, it's a beautiful place. Really nice. Uh, lots of cool stuff. It's it's like it reminded us of New Orleans, but on the beach yeah. or in the Caribbean. You know, it's really, really, really pretty. Um, but it's got that it's got that a lot of that Spanish architecture. Yeah, like New Orleans. Like New Orleans. Uh, a lot of the bars and restaurants uh, on the Ball Street. It's got that feel, New Orleans feel. Mm -hmm. So it was, a lot of them are old. They've been there for, you know, since right. close to 100 years. Yeah, it's, it's, it yeah. was just uh, lots to do. Yeah. Lots to do, lots to see, a lot of history there. Definitely somewhere we want to come back, whether it be we come here on our own or just have another port day here. I think another port day would probably be good um, because we got the lay of the land now, so we know where to go and what to do. Right. And we can just get a golf cart and go yeah. on our own. Yeah get a lot done in you know a seven eight hour port day yeah yeah getting a golf cart or uh, some scooters uh, is a good way to go in Key West no doubt about it you can get around you don't have to wait for a trolley yeah the trolley was cool for us because we've never been minutes, but you know sometimes it'd come and it'd be full yeah and you can't always get a seat we were lucky we were able to but a lot of people weren't um, yeah, and I can only imagine if there were more than one but, ship in port. You know, you got to take you at least one tour, get the just um, and your bearings, and, and get some little history. And the tour guides were great because they did give a lot of good information. And then you get your golf cart, kind of branch off on your own, and you kind of come and go as you please. Yep, I agree with that. So, so we're just chilling now. This is. I think this is one of our favorite decks. This is where the running deck is deck four. Yeah. So Jason runs here every morning. I walked this morning. You'll but have to show them what it, it looks like on the end. Yeah, it goes all the way around. And so some of it's open deck like this and some of it's more the industrial part of the ship, which is really cool to yeah. see. And you can actually fit, you know, in case of emergency. This is where the life boats are right here, but you can fit everybody on the ship on deck four. All the yeah, way this is where the this is where the mustard drill happens. So every passenger on board has to come out here on deck four. So it's pretty wide. It's yeah. nice. And shuffleboard's here. Yeah, we haven't played shuffleboard, shuffleboard yet. One shuffleboard um, each. on each side. Here's one of the shuffleboard courts. And this is cool. See, everything's right there. And so this would be it. I don't want to play right now, but this would be a good time of day yeah, good if time you time want it to because it's know. quiet. Look how beautiful this deck is. Oh, and you're right under the lifeboats. 
And they've got the benches you can sit. Or like down it. here, you'll see some loungers. You get a little bit of activity in the morning with people running. I mean, that's a lot of people walk and run on this side. Yeah, there's a lot of health, health conscious people on board. You can see where the, the deck narrows and you got just one little walkway. It goes all the way around. It's enclosed in the front and in the back. See, there's inside the lobby. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, you can see in the lobby. So yeah, we're gonna uh, we're gonna walk around and show you what it looks like um, going all the way around. It's pretty cool. So, and Jason said this is his favorite jogging track ever on any ship. Yeah. Well, you're not baking in the sun. Yeah, it's shady. And you get some you get some uh, cover spots where mm -hmm. it's cooler. So that's nice. And look at these loungers. Yeah, old classic. Nice. Style, so, beautiful. so you just come sit out here. It's quiet. Nice breeze blowing. Yeah, no baking sun. Right yeah, there's, we got some people just chilling out here. Yeah. But look, watch this. And look, see, here's three laps equals one mile. Around the ship. But this, you're gonna come through here. This is what's so cool. Because we've never seen this on any ship before where you get to go in this kind of area and it's part of the jogging trail. See, there's that. This is kind of the industrial side of the ship. Then you got a little dip where it goes downhill. Yes, see, look. There's a ramp that goes down here. And then look at this. This is so cool. There's your anchors. Anchor drop. Platforms right here. Yeah. Try, try to figure out where the pool is in the very front of the back. I think it's on deck five. We'll have to figure that out. We figure that out. We'll show you. But isn't that neat? We've never seen that. No, so that's so cool. So yeah, the it comes around. Yeah, it goes up right here. And then it levels back out. So this is neat. So there's a space like this at the front of the ship, and then there's a space like this at the back of the ship, and then the sides are open. All on deck door. It's awesome. It's fun. At least I walk with me. Yeah, <laughs> I walked about a mile and a half this morning, and he's been jogging it every day. But the padded chairs are comfy. Okay. But you can't plop down on because they are wooden chairs. <laughs> so we they, both went plop. And we're like, uh. <laughs> when you plop, they hit you back. Yeah, they do. <laughs> but when you lay down, it's nice. Yeah. Um, they're narrow, or these like the old school classic yeah. loungers, you know? Like yeah. you see on like the old, old ships. It's really classic looking. Yeah, there's a lot about this ship yeah, that reminds cool, yeah. us of a very, like the original classic transatlantic ships. That gives you that Titanic feeling. Shh, we don't say Titanic on a cruise ship. Oh, sorry. <laughs> But look at this view. You can see lights from mm -hmm. land over there. Yeah, we can see lights from the Keys still. <clears throat> but this is not a bad way to spend some time right here. Yeah, just to break up the, break it up, get quiet. Really soak it up, savor it. Yeah. The essence of a cruise, this is what it's like. This is what it is for us to just be on a quiet deck and listen to the... Yep, the, listen to the water. That's just... Listen to the ship cut through that water and turn it all up. What's the noise it makes, honey? <laughs> <laughs> and it Love does. We can sit here and we can hear that exact sound Think that Jason's making. That's, <laughs> that's one of the best things in the room, right? It is. I can just, like, take a nap right that's, here. That's one of the memories that you have when you take with you. That sound. 
so, the feel of the breeze. Right. So don't think you have to get that activity list and go, 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 because there's a million activities. Take some time to do this, because this is nice. That's what we do. That's what yeah. we Yeah, like we love to have some relaxed time. Yeah, so we noticed after we were sitting here, we're the only people on this deck. Out of all these thousands of people on this boat. There's yeah. nobody out here but us. <laughs> Something told me now's the time to come out here. Yeah. That's right. Oh, it's been we've been sitting here for a while. It's so relaxing. Look how beautiful what time too. is it? Uh, I don't Show know. Show the secret with our people. It is six o'clock. So you guys come out on deck four if you're on Disney Wonder around because half o'clock. the ship's going to dinner right now. Yeah, and you'll have this deck to yourself, and it's nice. Yeah. No secret. Shh. Don't tell nobody. <laughs> so we, yeah, we decided to play shuffleboard. All right, Jace, let's see what you can do. Okay, now let's get some practice. Redo. <laughs> you got to shove it pretty hard. Yeah, let me put one up. <laughs> Yeah, we each get one warm up one. Oh! I got a tin. Well, kind of. Well, that's it. It's in, it's in the tin. I get a tin. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's see here. Alright, so shuffleboard. All right, so we're gonna take this. I remember doing this one time. You gotta kind of bend down, put your leg into it, and go. That was terrible. You're in the tins. I'm in the tins. All right, let's see what you can do. Off. All right. You're starting on. You gotta start back here, though. Or do you start here? I think this is the launch pad. That's the launch pad, honey. Right here. Okay. I don't know. I'm not real good at this. No, wait, yeah, we're supposed to start. Both of us are supposed to start down here, and you're supposed to knock my off, aren't you? I don't know. We'll play it both ways, just for fun. Someone's gonna tell us the correct etiquette of shuffleboard because we sure don't know it. Okay, ready? One, two. That was terrible. All right, you did better than me. No, no. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna let her get by. All right, so we figured we're gonna line them up both here and shoot down. Okay, so it's my turn. Well, now Lisa gets a turn. Can you get on the launch spot? I don't know if that's a launch spot, but that's I'm our that's, it, that's our launch I'm spot. Calling yeah. It the launch spot. We're making up our own rules. Here, Pretty much. Okay? Ready? Well, not bad. Hey, hey! We got a uh, eight. I got something. All right, now I have to knock yours out. <laughs> I was doing really cool. My turn. I was doing really good. Now I'm not doing so well. I think Are I'm getting hungry. Are you going to put it on the launch pad? Yeah. Well, I'm just launching from here. Nah, you got to put it on the launch pad. Nah. Yeah, okay, ready? One. Oh! Way too off. Too hard. Too hard. Put it on the launch pad, honey. I got nothing. How about that? Zero. Zilch. I won. I kicked his butt. All right, so we gotta got we gotta put our rack them. I got two eights and a seven. Yeah, and I got zero, zero, <laughs> zero, zero. Thank you very much. Good I night, mean, everybody. So at Boiler Bites tonight, the special is the breaded spicy chicken burger, and we were told that it's amazing. So I'm gonna give it a try. 
and Jason's gonna, Mr. Chef Jason's gonna dress my sandwich for me. Darn tootin'. Darn tootin'. Give me some lettuce and tomatoes. Pickles. Oh, there's your brat, honey. Okay, thank you, sir. And the brat? Yeah. A little mustard. Probably be better with bread, but you know. It's a good brat. All right, now mine looks very different. Let's give that a try. I dressed hers up real good. Yeah, you did. Okay, so we had a um, a, crew, a cast member that said that she works here, and this is her favorite night of the week when they serve these. One night a week. Mm. I got some on my face. That's all right. If you don't got it on your face, you ain't doing it right. Mm. That's good. That is a very good. It's got a little kick to it, but it's not too spicy. But Jason dressed it properly. It's a good sandwich. Yeah. Spicy chicken sandwich. So we told we were told they changed the flavors. So we had to come look. So this is vanilla and chocolate in this machine. But this is mango and blueberry. And you can swirl it. We may have to come back later tonight and try that. You won't, huh? Nah. The one thing we just figured out is there's no buffet at night. None. So we were thinking that the next two nights we would skip our dining room and go to Cabana's and eat off the buffet. So we just went by to check it out. And I'm like, oh no, there's no buffet. It's table service. It's table service. It's anytime table service, but it's table service. I don't like that. I, I like, that's I my strike against Disney on this one. It is that you need a buffet, breakfast, yeah. lunch, and dinner. I yeah. mean, why are we, well, why, well, that makes no sense to me. I know. We really, strike. really, we really want it that because, you know, having 815 dining, is late for us yeah. and so we were like okay well, that's fine next two nights we'll just go and we'll hit the buffet nope and the pizza's closed negatory <sighs> no dumpty <laughs> strikes <laughs> overall great experience but oh, we do have to give you know we're, we're honest we, well, we're we very got, honest we, well the problem is we've gotten spoiled and used to certain things yes and uh yeah, yeah. No, this is honest, totally honest. I, I like I like buffets. I like to be able to go look and see and just maybe grab a little snack here and there. Yeah. On the buffet, you know, in between dinners. Yeah, especially when you have a late dinner like this, you may need a little something in between. So we were gonna go see if there was like some little shrimp or something like that. You know, just have a little snack in between, but no such luck. So anyway, we're heading to the Crown and Finn right now as they're showing the NFL games. And we're gonna see what game is playing. Saints won. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, it's lovely in here. Ooh, a lot like of people it. have the same idea. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, now it's starting to Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, cowboys are playing. Everybody's excited. Yeah. Oh yeah, here we go. But, but there's pub food. Cheap old wings, but they something to snack on. When all else fails, there's some wings in the pub, huh? Little baby wings. Yeah. They're tiny compared to what you had for lunch, huh? Like some real big jumbos. That's what I normally have at home. Yeah. We got some Dallas fans in here, and this is the Dallas game on right now. So we got some hooping and hollering in here, but this is going to be us. fun. Touchdown Cowboys! Everybody's excited! <laughs> All the screens froze, but that one, everybody was over here. <laughs> That was hilarious. Yeah, the minute left in the game and the damn TV freezes. And there's like and one like, TV. There was two, three TVs, the two are at the bar and one right there and everybody goes, everybody to the bar! And they all trample over like herd of elephants, man, to the bar. That was hilarious. 
You had to be here to see that. I know, that was so funny. Oh. You better be quiet. We're secretly rooting for the Eagles to win. Yeah, because the Dallas beat our Saints last week. <laughs> we won today, so we clinched playoff spot. But their defense helped us. They got a hell of a defense. But I think we're going to beat them long run. I think we're going to go further than them. But they beat us nonetheless, and I want to see them lose because of that. That's all. <laughs> but hey, we're in a we're in a tank full of. Dallas Cowboys. So we're just gonna be quiet. We're not stupid. There's 16 seconds left. This game's going into overtime. Watch these guys. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Yeah, we're going we're going into overtime. Four, three, two, one, overtime. overtime. <laughs> what happened? It, it, it looks like it bounced up and it It does. But hey, Dallas won. Everybody's happy. So that was a fun experience <laughs> watching that game. Had a good time. Full of Cowboys fans. We are not I Cowboys imagine, fans. But, I, but yeah, I, I get. I understand their joy. Yes. And their passion. If that would have been the Saints' plan, not the whole. Not have been all of it. Though. Yeah. But that was a fun experience. We enjoyed that. that. We got a real fun. kick out of watching those people. We did. That was hilarious. <laughs> We're going to dinner now.